Verse of the day the 17th of April 2024. Do not repay evil with evil or insult with insult. On the contrary, repay evil with blessing, because to this you were called so that you may inherit a blessing. 1 Peter 3, 9. Thoughts on today's verse. In this verse, we're urged to respond to evil with good, blessing others even when they mistreat us. This verse highlights the Christian call to emulate Christ's example of forgiveness and love, even towards those who wrong us. Instead of seeking revenge or harboring bitterness, we're encouraged to respond with kindness and grace, reflecting the character of God. This verse challenges us to rise above the natural inclination to retaliate and instead choose the higher path of love and reconciliation. By showing kindness and blessing those who mistreat us, we demonstrate the transformative power of Christ's love in our lives. It's a radical departure from the world's way of handling conflict, but it's the way of Christ, who calls us to love our enemies and pray for those who persecute us. Ultimately, this verse invites us to trust in God's sovereignty and justice, knowing that He sees and understands every situation. As we extend forgiveness and grace to others, we're reminded of the immense grace that God has shown us through Christ. By following this principle, we participate in God's redemptive work, allowing His love to shine through us even in the face of adversity. Prayer for the day. Heavenly Father, today, I come before you, humbly seeking your guidance and strength as I strive to live out the teachings of your word. Grant me the grace to respond to difficult situations with kindness and compassion, even when faced with mistreatment or injustice. Help me to see others through your eyes, recognizing their inherent worth and extending your love to them. Lord, empower me to resist the urge to retaliate or seek revenge when I encounter hostility or conflict. Instead, fill my heart with your love and mercy, enabling me to bless those who wrong me and to pray for their well-being. May your spirit work within me, transforming my heart and mind to reflect the character of Christ in every situation. Father, as I endeavor to follow the example of your Son, Jesus Christ, Grant me the strength to walk in his footsteps, forgiving others as he forgave and loving unconditionally as he loved. May your grace abound in my life, enabling me to demonstrate your love to a world in need of your healing touch. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen.